What's up there, YouTube? It's your boy Big Leonard here, BM Land Management out here in Phoenix, Arizona. Yeah, I just uh, finished up a lot here. Uh, actually, it's the first time uh, doing this, using this uh, this big dog trooper here, a little standard 36 inch uh, mower. Um, this. I've done this lot here about I think this is probably about the third or fourth time that that I mowed it, and it normally doesn't even take quite even near this long because usually I use my my big uh, my big mower the 60 inch uh, Diablo, and but anyways uh, I'm gonna share a little bit of share a little bit with you about this uh, mower here so. So here we go, uh, we have, this is a Big Dog Trooper, 36 inch cut, uh, Kawasaki FS541V, which is 15 horsepower, and this mower is, I'm actually just demoing it right now, because my uh, Diablo MP is at the shop right now getting some um, flex forks uh, put on and you know my dealer they wanted to you know bless me with them and so figure why not give it a shot try them out and then also uh, they wanted me to to uh, take this mower here and demo it and you know see what I think and this is something that I would definitely consider uh, as my company grows especially when I get to the point of where I am uh, acquiring more of these uh, backyards with these small gates but at this point in time I mean it's just a straight-up demo and I'm giving my honest opinion and and uh, hopefully you made it all the way through the end of this video uh, but uh, this is actually the first time I've ever mowed with a standard um, the only other time I've driven one was I think it was probably last week when I was at the dealership yeah last week or the week before and this unit it was just actually in their warehouse and so it was just sitting there and I went in and just kind of farted around with it a little bit and now I was thinking like oh okay you know this this probably would work you know if I ever came to that point but uh, anyways uh, let's see yeah it's more it's got uh, a fill gauge on the side there I think it's about a six and a half gallon fuel tank and uh, as you can see uh, you got you know throttle choke PTO engage key all that stuff controls forward and backwards uh, and there's a parking brake here and I don't know how the other brands of um, standards are but I know this one you do not have to uh, set the parking brake to get off of it while the engine is running alone and and but I know uh, you gotta disengage the PTO uh, so you got a uh, battery there on the side 
And this is height deck adjustment. I thought they did a pretty good job with putting numbers on it uh, like they've done on their other equipment instead of, uh, I guess, letters like some of the other ones. And uh, tire size wise, I think the rear tires are 18 inches. They're not very big. I know on some other brands, they're I think 20 and maybe even 23. What's up YouTube? Sorry about that. It's your boy Big Leonard here. I'm back here. My battery ran. Uh, went dead uh, earlier a few minutes ago. But uh, anyways, I uh, just want to get back to telling you about this about this uh, little this little trooper here. This little Diablo, I mean uh, Big Dog Trooper. So anyways, as you can see, uh, I think we're talking about these tires uh, where we left off at and they are yeah they're 18 inches tall and like I said other manufacturers uh, run bigger tires uh, for this size uh, mower um, the one thing that that, that I would uh, like to say uh, about this mower I, I actually felt pretty pretty comfortable uh, riding it and or driving it whatever whichever one you want to call it I felt like everything was in reach I didn't feel like I had to reach for anything that, that was on it and just uh, as I'm as I'm standing here I, I don't feel like I have to you know lean forward I think the only thing I probably have to have to lean forward with is when I go and uh, grab raise the deck um, right now it's at three inches and I barely have to uh, lean forward to to grab it and uh, pull it up and then the uh, parking brake is pretty much the same way you push it down and it uh, goes down there but I, I think like I said it is, this it's, it's a pretty sweet little more. I see you guys out there uh, running these. I know um, uh, Stet um, uses them. Um, I think he's got the little right standard, and I, I know that's his full time full time uh, ride, or, or you know, as far as mower goes. Um, I know. I think. Oh, and. Just to share a little bit, something else uh, that I that I kind of I guess like some pros and cons. Uh, one of the things that one one of the things that that I watched a video. I think it was about a month and a half, maybe two months ago, and it was a video with uh, Seth, the line surgeon, and. Uh, Seth was it was his first video on the on his uh pro stance. Yeah, I think it's pro stance, gravely pro stance. And he I I could tell like that was his first time <laughs> that was his first time uh you know driving that mower. And I knew the more actually the more he uses it, the more he get used to it and all that and and he kinda made some points that that I kinda already thought about when when using these uh, standards is is I know for me personally like even even if I had say a 60 inch one that had a 60 inch uh, deck on it that was bigger I, I don't see myself using it as a uh, full-time uh, mower uh, or as my main mower because because I, I don't like standing I mean I don't mind standing but but even just that little piece of property that I just did, I mean, my feet, I could tell my feet were kind of, kind of, you know, I needed to move around a little bit. And then also, um, uh, Seth mentioned about uh, your back. Uh, I didn't really feel, I felt a little bit uh, in my lower back just from leaning, but, but I was kind of more so just, 
leaning my knees into it and just a little bit above my thighs there and then the rest of the part of my body was just straight up because my arms are, are very long I'm six foot six inches tall and well over uh, 300 pounds so so uh, I didn't feel like I needed to to really lean forward uh, like some models or some uh, brands but but anyways I, I just wanted to share that with you I'm, I'm actually I probably had this more for a couple of days I'm, I'm gonna keep uh, playing around with it experimenting with it but I, I definitely know that for sure on on some uh, other properties or or just other jobs or whatever I, there's no way I would I would mow that much with this little mower not starting off I mean obviously you got to get used to it but but I am gonna keep playing around on it I mean I live on five acres I got probably almost two and a half that I can mow with but it, I don't really see myself mowing even the majority of it uh, with it but I am gonna keep playing around with it I got a couple other jobs I'm gonna do with it and and I will uh, keep on uh, I probably keep uh, recording get get a little bit more footage of it because uh, I'd like to see it in just regular grass you know that's a week or two out not you know a month like that other um, that you just saw and and something that doesn't have like all the weeds in it so but uh, anyways uh, I'll I'll, I'll, I'll uh, holler at you guys uh, later and and uh, I'll, I'll, um, I'll, I'll post this video and then I'll uh, obviously post post some more with it and just uh, give you some more of my thoughts on it but anyways have a blessed day and and uh, guys just um, you know just keep making it happen uh, just stay up you know on your on your business take care of your business and do what you gotta do and and that's, that's it. All right, later.